Swaggins here and welcome to Rare Breed. Now today's vlog, man guys, it's gonna be an awesome one. I'm actually gonna be heading out to the EB Expo. If you don't know what that is, that's the EB Games Expo where pretty much it's a, I guess, a, a small video game uh, convention where we're gonna be seeing up and coming titles so, uh, like Far Cry 5, um, the new Wolfenstein, which I'm looking forward to, uh, Gran Turismo, all these sort of cool stuff. Also, the God of War, they've apparently got a God of War experience thing happening there. So, I'm excited about this, guys, because uh, as some of you may know, I'm a huge gamer. By the way, if you do play uh, on like on the PlayStation 4, if you want to add your boy, add Gilly and your mama. I'll write it down in the description down below. And yeah, man, come play with uh, play with me and my fellas, my, my, my friends. Um, you know, the more the merrier. I'm always happy to play with my fellow subscribers. Not in that way, okay? I mean, play on the PlayStation, all right? <laughs> you dirty-minded people. But yeah, guys, so um, yeah, so we're gonna go to the EB Expo. It's gonna be a sick day. Um, I even got a possible review if I do a pickup at the Expo. We'll see what I've got, I don't know. But um, I'm excited, let's get out of here because I'm pumped. I know you guys are pumped. And what more can I say? It's a beautiful day over here in sunny Brisbane. What more can you ask for? Let's go check this uh, expo out. Come on. Guys, that's insane. That sizing of food is crazy. Even though we're lining up, fuck me. Making me hungry. Just the smell of it is fucking dope. But um, yeah guys, so you're probably asking, Gilbo, what game are you wanting to see? Well, I'm not gonna lie, they've got a God of War Expo here or experience. I don't know exactly what that entitles of, but I'm waiting for the new God of War, guys. And if you're a God of War fan, you know that, hey, that game is no joke. And especially now that it's um, all like um, Norwegian sort of like, uh, you know, Thor sort of, you know, that sort of mythology. So, mythology, sorry, mythology. I gotta learn how to talk. This is how excited I am. <laughs> if you hear, if you hear me getting jarred, guys, it's because I got mates with me. So, yeah, they're they're making fun of your boy. But honestly, guys, it's gonna be a sick day. I'm looking forward to that. I'm looking forward to the new um, uh, Wolfenstein because I'm a huge Wolfenstein fan. So yeah, guys, I gotta show you this wall. This wall is sick, and my boy Trevor from GTA is on it. Oh. So yeah, as I was saying, um, the new Wolfenstein I'm looking forward to, uh, the new Colossus. So, so, I played the first one that got dropped out, I loved it, so yeah. Um, what other games I'm looking forward to? Jeez, oh, I don't know, there's so many, but we're gonna go in there, we're gonna have some fun. Ah oh, man, it's a good day to be alive, good day to be a gamer. <laughs> but alright, let's just check out some of the people dressed up.
So I'm gonna line up for the Gran Turismo VR simulator, guys. It looks pretty fucking dope, I ain't gonna lie. Um, I don't know if I'll be able to capture any footage for that, but I'll tell you how the experience went, because that looks amazing. Check it out, man. It's got like the full racing seat simulation and everything. It looks insane. Check this out. Alright guys, I know I said I was going to vlog the um, Gran Turismo, but man, the line was insane and I'm done with lines guys, as you know. So we're going to go check up another games. So come with us. Alright, so we're going to the God of War experience. I don't know if they're going to let me film, but I'm going to chuck on the uh, GoPro. <laughs> Alright guys, so I'm going to film either one way or another. So yeah, let's check this out because God of War is going to be sick. An uninterrupted single shot of the new God of War. This year we wanted to approach it a little differently, give a, a greater breadth of the experience, show the journey that Kratos and Atreus are going to be going on. So, at this point right here, there's a really interesting thing. The, the, the yellow writing on the wall, the runic phrase, is actually going to be translated by Atreus in the final game. So this is the point where they're actually going to be met with a dead end, and it is only Atreus translating those words that gives them an indication that they should cast their arms in the lake. And then you will see at the end of this the sort of end result of that. But more importantly, we really wanted to dig into all of the aspects of the journey that Kratos and Atreus are going on. Covering the different monsters, as well as the different lands and even realms that you're going to experience. So as with the previous demo, we really wanted to show that the emotional core of the game is very different than any previous God of War game. Kratos is older. He is struggling with raising his son Atreus and deciding how much information he really wants to give about all the previous games because of the new camera. The ability to control where you're going to look at any given time is in the player's hands as opposed to the designer's hands. Throughout this journey, you're going to meet people who are friendly, you're going to meet people who are not so friendly. We wanted to show in this year's E3 2017 demo that the combat was still just as fast and frenetic as all God of War games. So you can see right now, I'll show you the shield, brand new weapon that we're that showing looks off. Insane. So everything you're doing while you're in combat, you're actually incorporating a lot of Atreus' moves into that. So you can see right here, Atreus is standing on the shoulder of an enemy, in mid combo, he leaps off, and firing that arrow was actually pressing the button. So at any time, you're able to call forth his abilities. The goal here really was to try to get a sense that you never really know when you're fighting a boss and when you're fighting a regular character. They vary in size so often that it always does feel like you're kind of in a boss fight. So, uh, for Kratos taking on the giant boss, and I kind of wanted to take the idea and flip it on his head a little bit, Facing you off against a giant creature that actually, in the story of the game, is there to help you rather than somebody that you're going to fight. Holy shit. Right there, the number of birds that fly in front of the World Serpent, nine. Nine and three are very sacred numbers in Norse myth. So you can actually see throughout the, the previous demos. Alright guys. Hopefully I got that footage for you. That was fucking dope. Dope God War experience. Uh, hopefully that came out all right, so you guys can enjoy. It. Even though I wasn't allowed to film, I still did. Yeah, boys, a rebel that way. Anyway, let's go check out some other shit that they've got happening here. Man, today is a good day. A good day. All right, guys. So we're at the Bethesda stand. We're just waiting in line to play the new uh, Wolfenstein. So hopefully it's gonna be sick. Man, I'm not gonna lie guys, I'm so sick and tired of waiting in lines. Oh, the lines are killing me. The lines are killing me. Yeah, if you saw like a little poster thing just popping up, it's a man of mine. He doesn't want to be shown. He's camera shy. But yeah. So guys, tell me on the comment down below, what game are you or what game are you guys looking forward to playing next year? And what console are you gonna play in here? Because man, I'll be honest with you, I was an Xbox boy. But man, Xbox sucks these days, and it pains me to say that because, yeah, I was a fanboy, I'll admit that, but going back to PS4. Oh, by the way, guys who do have the PS4 console, if you want to play with your boy, it's 
Gilly and your mama. Add me. Add me and we'll play, guys. GTA and all that. <laughs> but yeah, that's all made right there. But anyways, um, yeah, so I'll show you the game footage of Wolfenstein when we're in there. Hopefully they'll let me record. If not, trusty little man will record it. Stealth mode indeed. new Wolfenstein that was sick man um, the shooting mechanics on that is way better than the first one but it still has the, the that Wolfenstein feel man it's really dope guys if you guys can if you like your first person shooters if you like doom if you like the first Wolfenstein get on that shit that shit was fucking dope um, now we gotta get some grub man your boy's hungry so I'm not gonna film that because I know you don't want to see me eat so I'll see you guys soon Hey guys, okay, sorry to interrupt the vlog. I just, okay, so this is future, future Gilbo Swaggins, okay? Um, pretty much, I just wanted to quickly uh, just let you guys know about this vlog. Um, I filmed the outro, and then once I filmed the outro, I, I found these three items and I bought them, but I had to put them in this vlog, okay? Because I know you guys will think this is cool. And by the way, these are the item that I bought. They literally sold out straight away. It was only by sheer luck that when I went to the mega store that they had at EB Expo, uh, I asked the guy in the back, or I asked the guy if he could check in the back in the in the little maid storeroom that they had if there was any chance they had stock. Luckily, there was only three left. Three, and it was three of my favorite characters. That's a hint. Okay, so I'll quickly show you what they are. Now, these, this is going to probably be the new craze, I reckon, because, like, these are dope. And not only that, they're super cheap. Oh, I think I just showed you what it was. <laughs> All right, without further ado, guys, I bought Pixel Pals, Street Fighter 
edition pixel pals if you don't know what they are i'll show you in a second and um so i've got ryu i've got m bison and i had to get my boy akuma now you're probably thinking what are they gilbert okay well i'll show you what they are now these are like little cool like ornament sort of like uh I don't know, lighting sort of stuff. You'll see what I mean. So, let me take out M. Bison. So, this is how M. Bison looks like, right? Pretty cool, right? And, you know, it's like an 8-bit M. Bison, right? It's all pixelated. You turn him on. Yeah! <laughs> it looks a little bit too bright, but, like, trust me, when you look in person, it looks really dope, like an actual character. So, that's all they are. They're like little light-up ornaments you can put on your, you know, on your desk and or you know around the house and then you know just light them up they look really cool man quickly before uh, i don't want to make this vlog too long but guys if you like this vlog please give us a big thumbs up like smash the like uh, button but guys as a late you know i know that i got a lot of viewers and i uh, like i appreciate all my viewers i appreciate all my subscribers i love you guys all but let's at least get the like button let's let's try to like reach 50 i don't think that's an unreasonable amount let's see if we can get 50 likes for this vlog if possible okay um if not that's cool but yeah let's see if we can and if you're new to this channel subscribe but anyway enough of that so um let's just get back to the the ending of the vlog and you know what guys i'll just i won't even say to take it back all by swagger so let's just go check it out so we just found an old retro arcade place, man. These are the arcades I used to, I grew up on. You've got Lethal Enforcers, you've got Bubble Bubble, Street Fighter, man. Oh god, it's so dope, guys. Oh, 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 oh. OG, OG colorway. What's this shit? It's the Concourse, man. <laughs> All right, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh. Oh, serious, serious sweep action. Oh, sweep the leg, sweep the leg. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, the counter though. Now the power trying to... The counter go. Oh, 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 oh. Throw heavy, let's throw a light. Let's throw heavy again. Oh, shit. Oh, oh. Oh, lights! Oh, come back from the lights. brink! Lights! Heavy! Heavy! Light! Medium! Oh, oh. oh, he's gonna break! Ah, oh. 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 Alright, alright! Oh, right, right. Try that in for round two! Oh, no, no, it's all back. for Donkey Kong! Come back it's all for Donkey Kong! Oh. Oh. Nice! Oh. Nice! Oh, who did it come out? Oh, he got the three hits in. That was a good hit. Ah, oh, yes. Ah, oh, play a two side tonight. Light. Heavy. Heavy. Medium. Heavy. Okay, I let him win. I let him win. I let him win. Ooh, the head flap. Oh, it's Origin. It's Origin. It's Origin. He's gonna break. It's Origin. Oh, he's gonna break. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, damn you. Oh, boy! Oh, get off nice it. Ripped up by the nice fireballs, man. Nice and light. Oh! oh nice and light. Oh, man. Let's go heavy. The heavy. Barrage. Oh, the shit! Yes! Oh, yeah. oh, get out of here! <laughs> Bring it on! Alright. That was. I only let him win, guys. I only let him win. That was Screw that. Size. that <laughs> <laughs> I, can't, I can't lie, guys. I got my ass kicked by him. It's all fun in Love and War and Street Fighter. Fuck, can't believe I 
Not this much. This much. Oh, well, all right. All right, go for it. Shout out to my mom. Shout out to your mom. Yeah, my mom. All right. My friends, my little and brother. And the birthday boy. And the birthday boy. Oh, happy birthday. How old are you, bro? Oh. <laughs> nice, nice. Well, hopefully you have a great day. All right. All right, guys, so that's the end of the vlog. What more can I say? It was a dope day. Um, I'm sorry I couldn't get a lot of footage, game footage, because they weren't allowing, but I did my best. And if you guys get a chance to come to an EV Expo, do yourself a favor, go check it out. It is a sick day, great for the family. All right, uh, what more can I say until, until next time? Stay fresh, stay dope, because this is Rare Breed, baby, covering you nothing but the dopeness. Until next time, it's Gilboy Swaggin saying adios, au revoir, sayonara, peace, I'm out.